Okay, I-84, we're gonna get off on exit 27, Wilder Homedale. If you're coming from the other direction, obviously it would be just the opposite. Okay, coming up towards Greenleaf, Homedale, and all that stuff back there. We're gonna take West 19. Okay, coming through the little town of Greenleaf. Woohoo, population 982, I think. Put the lime in the coconut, then you feel better. Put Ooh, the yeah. lime in the Ooh. coconut, and throw me in the morning. Okay, so we're coming up to 95, and we're going to make a left hand turn. Or a right hand turn. Right. A right hand turn! We're with the homies going to Homedale. Check this out. Oh, here in Oregon. Yep, Oregon. Sucker Creek. Yeah, Sucker Creek. <laughs> okay, then we're gonna make a left hand turn right there. Right there up to the sun. There goes the big one. Okay, see the little sign down here? You're gonna make a route right there. Yep, yep, we are. If we turn left immediately after we, we go across the fence here, or mm -hmm. across the cattle guard, okay. then if you go down the hill, um, there's a lot of jasper and agate okay. where, where we've done a group field trip and kept people busy for hours out okay. there. So just to know that it's it's a point of interest for rock hounding. Right. If, okay. if you want. And we can just drive out there and okay. say, here's a, here's a place you Here might want to okay. check out if you want to. Yeah. yeah or we course. can go straight to the nodules. You tell me. Uh, I'm thinking nodules. Mm -hmm. What do you think of baby? Nodules. Yeah. We don't want no inking quartz. We want nodules. Yeah, but you gotta watch out because this this gravel was a little bit slick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It, we don't want to slide off that. Of, it's kind of like driving on ice at times, and so yeah. It, yeah. it's almost like you hydroplane when you go fast. Yeah, well, it's not slide it'll, up the it'll, today. It'll go. Probably, Probably wouldn't be good for your car. Either. Yeah. Okay, do the little well. fence post right here, and that thing's left up yet. And this is just one of our guide's tips. So one of the, the challenges that, that we run into is that when we're out of cell phone range, out in the middle of nowhere in Sucker Creek, because Sucker Creek is, is vast, as is Graveyard Point, um, you need to have some type of navigation. And if you don't use like a, a Garmin or a TomTom, -Tom, and you want to rely on your phone, there's a map or a, a map application called Onyx Hunt. And people use it for hunting. It has some, some nice features. One of them is, is it will still use your GPS on the phone to show you where you are and the, and the basic um, topography or the, the map of, of where you are. You can download ahead of time a, a map to look at offline. You can also mark um, waypoints, the points of interest ahead of time. And um, another thing is you can start and stop routes to track where you've hiked or where you've driven so that you can retrace steps, you can mark high points. Um, long distance hikers will use it for geocaching. You can look that up, but anyway, it's a, it's a really useful app for much more than just hunting. Okay, check this out, you guys. This, you're gonna watch out for this creek right here. Sucker Creek. Sucker yeah. Creek. Sucker. Go Don't be a sucker, yeah, go for All it. Right. Huh? 
I did not see Jim. Randy thinks he can get through without getting us stuck. You be the judge. Excellent. Here we go.